Hey folks, this is Rick Brown here of Bayou Knives. Just got back off of vacation, got back home yesterday about 9.30 last night. Been out in the shop, thought I'd just give y'all a little update. I've been cleaning and straightening and redoing. and uh, It's just a portable metal building. I've got it hooked, as you can see my little cubby hole. I got it next to my shop that has my four wheelers and lawnmowers in it. Put a little cubby hole. I just installed this table made out of a two inch solid core, solid wood core steel door with heavy duty legs. Because of uh, poor circulation, a bad back, having a heart attack, I have to do most of my work sitting down. So I built this to uh, do my grinding on. As you can see, here's my new Grizzly 1015. I just used it today to profile a couple knives. I'll be doing a little video on it tomorrow. Yeah, believe me, it's it's a world of difference going from that little uh, Harbor Freight one by thirty and that four by thirty six Harbor Freight grinder down to that. It's just unbelievable with that thirty six grit Norton blade belt. And then uh, coming on around, cause I got a hydraulic press there that I use to straighten and stuff. But anyway, there's my. Uh, Milwaukee Tools bandsaw, mounted there, portable bandsaw that I use for cutting out my knives, my Delta drill press, a uh, Craftsman scroll saw, a Rockwell uh, bench grinder with a uh, sizzle wheel on the left and a stitch muslin wheel on the right for polishing. Then I have uh, shells that I store my handle material, soldering material, sharpening equipment, tools and clamps and then over here is the main work table where I uh, do my assembly of course it, it looks like chaos that's what I call it organized chaos and I got a knife gluing up right here I'm putting black onyx black gold onyx handles on a knife for a boy for a New Orleans Saints knife he's a big New Orleans Saints fan I got that gluing up there's a, another piece of the black onyx right there Got a fillet knife there to finish. Got another little knife right here, a little neck knife to finish up. I just got back. There's all my patterns. Lots of clamps. You have to have all kinds of clamps. Can't do, be without enough clamp. I got a little air compressor right there. Uh, I'm gonna do away with most of these shelves here. And this will be my Kydex and leather making. Down on that end down there, I got a little toaster oven. Got to put some more insulation in the ceiling and the walls. I've got a little air conditioner getting awful hot. As you can probably see up on the wall, some motorcycle centerfolds. I used to shoot for a magazine called uh, Thunder Roads, Louisiana Biker Magazine, and I shot all the centerfolds uh, for the magazine. As you can see, I've shot quite a few of them. That's Bayou Photography, Rick Brown there also. Just, uh, just a few of the things that I do. Not only am I a knife maker, but uh, I'm also a uh, photographer. So anyway, there's the shop. As I said, it's still a work in progress. We're still cleaning and rearranging and straightening, but I got a lot of room and a lot of work and a lot of potential that I can do and a lot of things I can do. So I hope y'all enjoyed. There's my belts. I've got to organize my 2x72 belts. Put them on that pegboard over there. And i uh, got to do some electrical wiring. Right now I'm still running off of heavy duty extension cords, but I want to completely wire it when I insulate and seal it. But as you can see, this is Bayou Knives Shop, located at 240 Highway 578, Crowville, Louisiana. Phone number is 318-267-4309. This is Rick Brown for Bayou Knives. I hope you enjoyed the tour.